Hello friends! Today we are gonna talk about MQTT tiles, a freshly made tool for dashboard creation and data visualization. What is special about tiles is that it expects MQTT topics as the source of data. What it does is subscribes to the specified topics on the broker and shows topic payload in the selected format, for instance a gauge, a text, and so on. MQTT tiles can also publish data to the topics, thus also supporting actionable controls, toggles, buttons, radio buttons, and more. Let's see how it works. What we do first is create a connection to the MQTT broker that MQTT tiles will use to subscribe to the required topics. You can specify the connection details of any MQTT broker supporting secure WebSockets protocol. We are going to use FlashP MQTT broker here. Specify the token and save. To activate the connection, you just click on it. It should turn green if successfully established. Now we can start creating boards collections of widgets that will visualize specific values or perform specific actions. Okay. Click the plus sign here. Now you can give the board a name and save it. Go to the full board view and start adding widgets. So, let's start with a very simple text widget. Let's pick it here. Now, you can give it a name. Say, well, display channel traffic. You can pick the color. And the most important step here is to specify the MQTT topic to get the updates from. Okay, there we go. Now we click Save. And here is our widget of the desired color already having the current value of the given channel traffic. If you start the widget, you will be able to see it on the minimized board view, like this. It's worth emphasizing that for action widgets you can specify one topic which state the widget will listen to and another topic which state the widget will change. Okay, let's create one action widget together. It will be a toggle which will turn the Flespy stream on or off. Okay, we pick the color. Now we'll listen to the topic like this. Then we need to switch to advanced command mode. And we paste another topic here and here. This is the action topic, the topic that we will publish to. And the value is true here and false here. And we also change the expected values here. Now, when we click save, we get our switch here. Now let's see how the switch works. So we turn it off and you see this tree turns off. We turn it on and the stream goes back on. Okay, now that we have a nice dashboard, we can share it with someone else. Here is the share button. When you click it, you are offered to copy a link to dashboard for sharing. We click copy. Then let's open a new tab and 
see that it works, and it does. This was a brief introduction into MQTT tiles, an MQTT-based dashboard visualization tool. Check the dedicated article on our blog for more details. The project will definitely expand and mature, so more features will follow and some interface changes might occur. Subscribe to our channels to stay tuned and thanks for watching. Bye.